hello everyone welcome back and uh, so last class we have discussed uh, and in the last video uh, we have discussed the inheritance concept of typescript so now we will start with uh, a class which implements an interface okay uh, because we discussed uh, interface defines the type uh, right so it defines an object to type like what are the properties should be there what method should be there first declaration we have to make and later on on top of that we have to make a implementation so till now we just write only implementation so let's create the definition the rule and uh, a class implementation we'll see okay so first of all uh, let me create a fresh uh, folder 14 hyphen uh, ts hyphen oops uh, inheritance sorry interface interfaces okay so let's create one uh, typescript let's say app okay so first of all you have to define the rules uh, that will be interface so let's say interface i student uh, generally we will specify with the uh, character called i uh, to indicate it's an interface okay so class name will be just student interface will be i student it doesn't mean that if you just write an i it is an interface you have to write interface okay so student so now here um, let me declare some variables here so let's say first name of type string because in my object when i uh, the moment i create a student object so that object should contains what are all the properties what are all the methods that I'm writing here okay first name should be there uh, last name should be there is string type and age uh, number and uh, course string required and moreover uh, what else you do okay first name last name age and course okay fine next uh, I want to specify the methods also here so not just getters and setters, uh, you have to specify the actual instance method in the interface. I need a method called uh, full name. Uh, that is just empty function parameter that should return a void type. You can specify the functions in interface like this. And uh, one more biography. Biography. This is also a wide function okay so this is my interface student and on top of this i have to create a class which satisfies the interface so let's say class capital student uh, and how you to give a connection between a class and interface how to give a connection uh, previously we have seen right a parent class subclass so subclass uh, uh, extends from the parent extends keyword now same way class if you class is implementing the rules of interface so you use the keyword called implements so let's say implements i student so as soon as i write implements uh, you got the error because you are not satisfy all these things okay so let's specify all the implement implementation for all these properties and methods so let me declare them so first name of type a string again mm, last name of type string age of type number and uh, course of type string and you have to specify the constructor so constructor constructor so constructor yeah you have to initialize okay so let's take the first name and last name uh, age and course so these are, the, these are my values so let me assign to my local uh, uh, properties so let's say this dot first name is equal to first name okay and this dot last name is equal to last name and this dot age is equal to age and this dot uh, course is equal to course okay and i think you have to specify 
okay you have to specify the type as well it is string type this is also string type age is of type number and course is of type string so you have to specify like this constructor but still you are showing there because you implement only the uh, properties you are not implement for the methods okay let's make the methods full name and uh, biography i can do one thing full name written string i take okay you're going to return the string back so here let's say public full name method so this oblique string so this is going to return this dot first name uh, i use like i use like this back tick uh, here this sorry this dot first name and also let's say this dot last name okay so this is my full name implementation just returns a full name first name and last name and biography so public biography uh, returns nothing just void okay so what is biography means uh, full name and uh, age and course everything about a student okay so let's bio of type string is equal to bio of type string is equal to back tick let me write uh, like this full name full name let me uh, you can say either first name and last name or let's call the method called full name so let's say this dot uh, full name you call and moreover so h let's say this dot h and next uh, course course will be what this dot course that's all so full name is there and biography is there and uh, no written type just void so let's say normal console dot log of bio so you're gonna implement like this see now there is no error so interface you specify all the rules and in the class you will specify the uh, implementation of all the things okay fine and now let's call first i took i want to create an object for class okay so interface you can't create an object only for class you create an object okay because interface contains just rule no implementation so what's the question of creating an object you only create objects for classes okay so let's um student is equal to new student and this is gonna call what the constructor function method so you have to specify all the four first name last name age and course so let's say here first name uh, arjun last name ready and uh, arjun ready age uh, 25 codes mbbs okay that's all so let me call the biography it prints everything of a person right so directly as a student dot biography okay so let me run the program open terminal let's say ts uh, node space app dot ts so you get see arjun ready age and course okay so this is uh, how you gonna implement an interface okay and you're gonna even write uh, some extensions of uh, next class also okay inheritance also you write so that's all about interface implementation okay so that's it thank you so much and let's meet in the next video and we'll see some other concepts of object oriented thank you so much for watching and please subscribe to my channel and we'll meet in the next video thank you